with other dogs and members of your family. You can also consider singing up your poodle for a number of classes and play opportunities that will help teach it to become biodiverse and friendlier. Puppy day care sessions is a good opportunity for that. As an owner, make it a point to show calmness when dealing with your poodle while at the same time showing it that you are welcoming to it. It is a no-notice gold poodle puppies for the sole reason that they are too young to actually know better. At the same time, scolding a poodle pup will result in an early exposure to aggression on your part, something that it will eventually mimic as it deals with others, and will become the starting point for many behavioral problems that last in the long term. If the poodle bites another dog, whether that dog is a puppy or a much bigger dog, put your foot down and send the message across, this is something that is not allowed. If the poodle is showing signs of wanting to bite, give it a toy that it can bite instead of other dogs. If it bites you, make a soft but clear whimpering sound so it knows that you are hurt by what it did. This smart dog will take its cue and, given that you are its loving owner, will strive not to bite you again. At the same time, this is how the poodle also shows being hurt when it is in the receiving end of pain. There are also some older poodle dogs that still demonstrate a desire to bite or just nip other people and dogs, and when this happens you need to address the problem with firmness. Your first move should be to show the poodle that you are the Pax Alpha, the leader of the household. To show that you are the leader, take control of the dog's feeding times and walking schedule. Do not let it dictate when it wants to eat or play. Spend time teaching it some basic commands, and persist until it grudgingly shows that it can obey. You also need to avoid playing physical games like tug-of-war, wrestling, and chasing, because these games can result in the poodle biting you in an attempt to establish its dominance. If the poodle is anxious and starts biting as a result, you can probably enroll it in obedience classes so they can socialize with other furry friends and have a way to address their aggression problems in a highly controlled environment. If the biting problem in your poodle persists, more drastic measures in the form of a dog expert may be necessary. You can also think about visiting your vet just to rule out any possible health concerns that may be a cause of its biting. Teaching your poodle not to bite and addressing aggression issues may sometimes be a challenge to a dog owner, but if you persist at it you will revel in how obedient and well-behaved a poodle can actually be. Thanks for watching. For more dog training tips, click on the link below and get your free dog training video series.